Faber of Faber Bright. Hey, how's it going, man? Man, it's it's been a year in the making. I mean, we we've been in the studio for the last like year and a half working on our next record. It's coming out at, in the fall. It's called Lost in Paradise. So we're just so excited now. We got the songs together. We believe in the record. We just want to get it out and get to and get on the road again. So we got a new single called Candy Store that's hitting iTunes on Tuesday. Nice. And we'll end on this favor. Father's Day. What did you do? Uh, I uh, remembered my dad passed away in '95. It's a bit of a shout out to anybody. Who's who's uh, had a father pass away, and uh, he was a good man. He taught me love, taught me about God, taught me about life. Do you and, do like uh, uh, any sort of thing on Father, like a prayer or anything, or what do you do? Do you sort of have a moment? Uh, I just I just take a moment, remember him, you know, and remember my roots and, uh, you know, what he taught me and what life is really about. Carly, Ray, hi! Here's the thing, Carly Rae Jepsen, how excited are you to be performing at Kiss 85's Wham Bam? I honestly cannot wait. What can you tell us about what you're going to be doing at Wham Bam? Maybe give us a little bit of a hint. See, I haven't quite decided yet, so I can't say for sure. Nice, and your song, number one, like everywhere. How cool is, I mean honestly, Call Me Maybe is like the number, most number one thing of all time. Oh, thank and you. the song of the summer. Thank you so, so much. It's so kind of you to say. I mean, uh, hearing that it's been very mind-blowing. The bigger the better, the bigger the better. Oh, that's so cute. How are you, Nelly Furtado? How are you? I'm good. So good to see you again. Thank you. So, the success of Bigger the Better. This is a big, huge, massive song. Song of the Summer. How does it feel? Um, it's exciting. I get to perform it every And it's um, amazing performing it to you. It's really special. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I just shot a video for the next season, too. Sorry to distract you. I shot a big one, right? Grouse Mountain. Perform, uh, you did was at the American Music Awards not too long ago. That must have been really, really cool to do that. Uh, American Music Awards. Uh, oh, Billboard to me? Billboard, yeah. Fantastic. You did perform in front of all your musical peers, represent. And uh, I mean, we're going to be all over the place this summer, just performing all the songs. Well, right? I'm thinking because you and I, I don't know if you've heard this or not, but Roz and Mocha have done a remix of me and you singing. So I'm thinking you and I should hit the road. I want to. You were good. I know, so, and it's like, uh... You were real yeah. good there. It's the most requested song. I think Kiss should be a little nervous. You might lose him soon. Well, our version is Big Ego. Dammit, Maury, Big Ego. And it's the most requested song. That's Can I hear it? Yes, I love you. So, but it's me going, the bigger, the better, the bigger, the better. And it's the most awesome thing ever. That's, I want to hear it. Okay, we can, we can arrange that. Okay, Father's Day. Nelly Furtado, what do you do? Oh, I called my daddy this morning. He's so sweet. What do you say to your parents. dad when you call him? I love you, Daddy. And, um, geez, you know, talk to him about the garden, the usual. <laughs> okay, last thing. Let's, should we do one line? Let's talk about one the line. figs. Ready? We're going to do a line the fig tree. There we go. The bigger, the better, the bigger, the better, the bigger, the better, the better, the bigger. The bigger. Oh, oh, he gets that. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait, wait. Do, you do, the, do the interim when it goes, yeah, yeah. Okay, good. So the bigger, the better, the bigger, the better, the bigger, the better, the bigger, the better, the bigger, the better. my favorite song of all time. You know that, right? You're so sweet. My favorite song. I, I made love it. it for you. And I tweeted you. I was singing that in the shower. Really? Yes. Oh my my God. shower song is Big Hoops. I love that. Oh, what's, my, what's your favorite line other than that? The bigger the better part. Okay. <laughs> I love you, Nelly Furtado. I love you too. Connor Mater. What is happening? Oh, it's so good to see you again. Uh, good to see you too. I love that. Oh my god, so let's talk Wham Bam. You're going to be at uh, Kiss 92.5's Wham Bam. Yes, I'm going to be there. Wham Bam. It's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, what can you give us? Because like, it's our show. I want some secrets. What are you going to do? I'm going to do Yeah, show. what can we expect at Wham Bam from you? Oh, I'm going to be utterly naked the entire time. Okay, you know we have that on tape. That better be your <laughs> Okay, maybe I was lying. But, um, <laughs> whatever it is, it will still be very fun. So. Okay, this just in. Connor Maynard will be naked at Wham Bam. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How's the summer been so far? It's been incredible. Um, I've spent a lot of it kind of, you know, around the world, seeing these amazing places. And I'm, I definitely Toronto is up there, it's one of my favorites.
What's up, everyone? This is Paul Maynard, and I cannot wait to be a kiss in 1995 Dude, you know what? When we're at Wham Bam, how old are you? I'm 19. So, can I drink with you? Man, let's get crunk. Can I get let's you drunk? Let's get drunk. I can Crazy drink you, dude. I can drink you under the table, man. Okay, is that a promise? Well, we'll see. I mean, if you can handle it, then okay. you know, we'll do it. What's your drink of choice? My well, drink of choice will be Jägerbomb. Oh, oh my god, god. that's my favorite. Is yes, it? let's do it. Yeah. You and me. Okay, Father's Day. Connor Maynard, Father's Day was this weekend. What'd you do? Father's Day was, I rang my dad. It's like the first thing I did when I woke up this morning. So, uh, I, um, uh, I rang him. And, uh, what does a Connor Maynard say to a, a Mr. Maynard? Happy Father's Day, Dad. No, I haven't got you a car yet, but it's coming, so... And so many people want to know, are you related to Emily Maynard from The Bachelorette? <laughs> I don't think so, no, but I'll have to look into it, maybe. <laughs> You're lucky. <laughs> okay, all right, Jesse Metcalf, how are you? Oh, what's up, man? Awesome! Jesse Metcalf, it must be so much fun being on the new season of Dallas. It's incredible. It's incredible. Working with Larry, Linda, and Patrick, the three original cast members, is such a blessing, man. They, they are just the coolest people. They're so, so gracious and have been so welcoming and supportive, and I think that's why we've created the show that we have, and we're very proud of it. Lord Overstreet! Hey, how are you? Lee, how are you, man? I'm great, I'm great. It's having a great, great fun time here in Toronto. I wish, I wish this was like smell -o radio You smell awesome. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Yeah, we need a 4D radio. <laughs> you do, seriously. So, how cool is it to be at a, at a show like this? It's probably something like you've never done before. Oh, uh, yeah, it's, it's definitely interesting because it's outside, and the fans are crazy, and the atmosphere is great. And it's starting to cool down a little bit from earlier today, so that's, that's awesome, too. So. I have to ask you this. There's been rumors of Adam Levine, the possibilities of Adam Levine coming on Glee, Toward Overstreet. What says you? Uh, I haven't heard anything about who's coming on next year. But, I mean, he's a talented guy. It'd be, fun, it'd be a fun time, but, I mean... I'm sure, I'm, sure it's, I'm sure it's very, very possible. Probably, probably. I don't How know. How cool would that be, though? That'd be it'd, awesome. It'd be fun. I mean, I have no clue what, but what they're planning to do. But do you do, think so. that if you were singing ugly and Adam Levine was there, he would judge you like it was the voice? Um, it'd no. be a lot of pressure. No, because you'd be working with him. No. Okay, fair enough. But yeah, no, I love Adam, and uh, he's a super talented guy, so it'd be, it'd be awesome to have him on the show. But I have, I have no clue. I know that him and, uh, I know that him and Ryan are... Okay, Ed Sheeran, how are you? Good, how are you? I am well. We can't wait to see you inside the Kiss Studios tomorrow. This is awesome. I love it's that. the Kiss 92 5 head cam. That's amazing. Now, I have to say to you, with, uh, with the utmost love, Ed Sheeran, you brought Ginger back. Thank you. You know what? I was I, I was walking through Bristol the other day, and I saw this ginger dude. It, it wasn't it wasn't that good looking with the hottest girl holding hands, and I was like, we're doing something. Because you put the guy from Harry Potter in your video, who's a redhead, and you're like a very attractive redhead. So single-handedly, you're making redheads like the most popular thing. I love it. Um, well, it's 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 not what I'm trying to do, but I'm glad it's having an effect. <laughs> like I, like hypothetically, right? <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's all. It's all part and parcel. I'm just trying to put out good music, and uh, thankfully the ginger thing is, is is coming back. Sure. Hey guys, how's it going? Dan McMorry from the Rise of Mocha Show, Kiss 92.5. Oh, what's up? Where did you got a helmet, Campbell? Yeah. yeah. So, MMVAs, how do you think it went? You guys even got Manny from Modern Family to dance with you. Oh, oh yeah. It was an amazing experience. Yeah, he didn't bring his mother, but uh, he was a shuffling uh, wonder up there on the, on the stage. You guys happy with how you guys did as co-hosts? Oh yeah, yeah, that was the first time, but uh, it looked like, you know, we been doing it every night. Natural. Oh yeah, we had a lot of fun, a lot of fun. And this is what we do during our show. Yeah. Every night on tour, you know, we're always going back and forth with the banter and stuff, so it was great. Yeah, it was fun. What up? Uh, it's this guy. Come on over. How you doing, Dan? How was the MMVA for you? Oh, man, it was like sugar and spice and everything nice, and I am bursting with fruit flavor. Do you know what I mean? Yes, I do. Okay, good. Cool. So, i got to ask you this, though. By the way, Justin's call me, maybe. You must be doing a killing on that. Um, He's watermelon there. I'm not skipping lunch. <laughs> well said. Thanks. You must love the success of that song, though. Yeah, it's great for Carly, and it's, and it's been great for me. We all got really lucky. It's fantastic. Nice, and I love your look tonight. Thanks. I love your look tonight. The little helmet camera thing. It's like you're a miner from the future. <laughs> you have to talk to him. 
What's up? Do photo, do photos, and we'll ask you two questions. Yes. 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 Got the same Please, thank you. I have to buy a new camera though. How did that all light? You have to And then over just a little. Oh, boom. Here, guys, just for a quick second. Okay. Boom. What am I here again again? Over here? What's up? Head on over here. Head on over here. Awesome. Thank you. Head on a minute. Okay. LMFAO, how are you guys? Yeah, man. Doing, doing good. good. All right, so MMVAs, how do you guys think you did? Did you do a good job or what? Oh, man, we think we did a great job up in this. Yeah. yeah. All I can say is we had a bunch of fun. You know? Yeah. You got the guy from uh, Modern Family, little kids that dance with you. Right? Yeah, man. He was amazing. One of the best chefs I've seen in a long time. Yeah. All right, so it was Father's Day weekend. What did you guys do? Did you do anything special for Father's Day? Um, you know, we was out here. You know, you no know phone calls? Oh, oh, you know, a little phone call. I don't know if that's special, yeah. but it's what we could do. You What'd know you what say I mean? to Dad? Uh, we said, you know, you, you first get on the phone and you, just, you, stay, you start with a happy Father's Day. That's, that's right. First time. You can't start talking and then at the oh, end. by the way. By the way, happy Father's Day. That's weird. So we started with that and then, uh, you know, we went down just to life and stuff. And, you know, Dad is proud. And that's what makes us proud and happy that Dad is proud. Did you have an awesome time with Madonna at the Super Bowl or what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Madonna's amazing, man. She's an icon and she's sexy and she knows it. Nice. Thank you guys. All right, Thanks. thank you. Yeah.